Hello everyone. I am Maggie and I am going to illustrate how to make a shaggy mat. Some people call them shaggy rugs, some people call them rug mats. It really doesn't matter the name that you use because at the end of the day you're going to have the same product. These are the things that you're going to require. You will need yarn or knitting thread, different colors if you wish. And one point to note is that yarns come in different thicknesses. Some are very thin, as you can see, and some are very thick, like this one. The most preferred is the thick one. But if you do not find the thick one, you can always do the thin one. I will show you how to make use of it. You are also going to require scissors. You are going to need a marker pen for drawing the design that you want on the mat mesh before you start you are going to require a crochet this is a normal crochet for knitting i will show you how to make use of it and or you can use or you can get the one that has a latch see this bit here it closes in when you're pulling the thread like that you can have either of these, I'll show you how to use them. You are also going to require a tape measure because you need to know the length and the width of your shaggy rug. And last but not least, you are going to need your mesh mat. Some people call them plastic mesh. Now this is the standard length that I got. It's one meter long. And some width but you don't have to make use of the whole of it see it is really big and it covers the whole of me but if your shaggy rug is going to be small then you can always cut to the design that you want at the end of this project we want to come up with something like that see that shaggy rug on the floor that is what we want to make now let's start first of all cut the length that you want i have already done mine and done already started designing 